So the Coral Eclipse then is the first race today. It's the first big group one where the three year olds take on the four year olds and upwards. And it's a mile and a quarter at Sandown. Top one is Siren Obi Wan. Horse number two doesn't count the train as a cheat. Three Persian Conquest, Leon van Rensburg. Chocolate Brownie, Joshua Sutherland, Action Man, David Robertson, Loophole, Jay Shea, Murder Hay, Martin Gaines, Doug's Fuzzy Screen, Rhodes Warren Syndicate, Out for Coffee, L. Hammond, Susa Jengi, Molly at Surfer, Mandala House, Jules Hughes, Mr. Clark D. Hinton, Bayonetta Thunderspark, and Blue Melon D. Thompson. Well, I was interested. Chris Parker's horses have all been disqualified from the league because he's been caught cheating, so we'll just ignore his horse and ignore him. And away they go. And who's going to be the first to show? Looks like Doug's fuzzy screen might be the first one to properly show with Murder Hay. Murder Hay is the one up the centre of the track with the uh, blue cap. We totally ignore that horse that's out in the front because it is of absolutely no significance to anybody apart from the idiot that cheated and uploaded it. So Blue Melon is the leader then from Susie Jengi. And loophole, then Doug's fuzzy screen and bayonetta and action man, and then Mr. Clark and Persian conquest murder hoys after that one, and siren and out for coffee, and then Mandala House is just the bat marker. So the horse in the red, then Blue Melon, is the official leader from Susie Jengi in second, then comes loophole in third, and bayonetta's back in fourth, then comes action man and Doug's fuzzy screen. The granny outside of that one is Persian conquest, and they're already at the six furlong pole. And Blue Melon continues to take them along then from Susi Jengi in second. Then Loophole is third. Bayonet is after that one in fourth. Then Action Man. Doug's Fuzzy Screen's got the rail. Persian Conquest the Grey is going to have to go the widest way around. That leading group is just a length or two clear of the remainder. We're headed by Murder Hoy. And then Chocolate Brownie and Siren with Mr. Clark out for coffee and Mandala House. The back markers. So Loophole swooping around the outside now. And Doug's Fuzzy Screen is coming up the inside. But the leader was still just Blue Melon there as they now make their way towards the straight and it's the grey action man that's now come through to dispute the lead with Doug's fuzzy screen so action man and Doug's fuzzy screen then from Susi Jengi and then Blue Melon Bayonet is still there as well loophole on the outside but they're now racing down towards the two furlong mark and at this moment in time it's loophole on the outside that's just the leader from Doug's fuzzy screen then comes after that one Lee Gray is action man but Doug's fuzzy screen's hit the front he's being pressed by loophole on the wide outside Murder Hayes finishing like a train then comes action man and Bayonetta but it's Doug's fuzzy screen in the lead on the uphill finish now inside the final half foot on a Doug's fuzzy screen has got this one so not Bayonetta is finishing quickly but up towards the line it's going to be Doug's fuzzy screen that takes it from Bayonetta second Blue Melon was third Murder Hay fourth and Chocolate Brownie was fifth. So Doug's Fuzzy Screen for Rhodes Warren Syndicate wins it. Bayonetta is second, Blue Melon third, Murder Hay fourth, and Loophole was fifth.